Hello everybody, welcome back to Mosh Pit Reactions. Today we have new music from Asking Alexandria. This song is called Bad Blood. We're going to be doing back-to-back -back Asking Alexandria songs because it turns out they just dropped one today called Cycle, which we will be reacting to next. Um, only song I've heard that they've dropped recently is Dark Void. Well, it's their most recent. Yeah, exactly. And uh, have you heard Asking Alexandra before? Like, just a couple songs, yeah, like Into the Fire, Moving On. Uh, oh, you so Black. You, you've heard them in the middle. Not the American Average. Okay, not the American uh, Average. There's another one, too, I'm forgetting. But yeah, mm -hmm. I've heard some stuff. Yeah, so you kind of got, like, the idea of them before, after Danny left when he came back before they started switching up their sound yeah um so i grew up with asking alexandra well i mean they're behind you i don't know where but... well i guess beside you oh yeah so, yeah um they uh I, I i grew up with them um first song i ever heard i think was actually a punk ghost pop song for Akon's right now. <laughs> um, yeah. And I was hooked right away. Um, and then the next song I heard after that was Not the American Average. Fuck yeah. So, uh, it's a good song. A great song. I, I, I love old school asking Alexandria. And all the way until I didn't like The Black, the album The Black. Uh, I did not like their vocals at all. I still listen to it just because it's asking Alexandria. But um, Ask Alexandra is one of those bands that I really enjoyed uh, growing up with. Um, they kind of threw me off with their second last album. Um, and then they came out with the one with uh, their last album that came out that, like, I. Oh, it's one of the songs I showed you on that one. It had. Uh, the song that kind of sounded like Enter Sandman at the start. Alone Again. I oh, think. yeah. yeah. Um, okay. I, I had to think of the lyrics. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but, uh, yeah. So, Jer Jeremy doesn't fully know what Asking Alexander is capable of. We both have heard Dark Void. Uh, and Dark Void was kind of a misled. Because they were explaining how heavy it was going to be without it being actually as heavy as they were trying to explain it to be, because they were saying old asking Alexander is back, and nothing could top, like, prophecy, uh, yeah. not the American average, like, all that kind of shit. Um, and I, I wasn't upset with Dark Boy. I was not upset with it. I liked it, especially for them using Danny's vocals the way that they are now. Because I know he's getting older and everything like that. He left to become a country singer, for a little bit then came back and that's when they all started to change their sound around a little bit more but this i'm excited for so without further ado as always open up this pit are you ready of course Let's go i was not expecting that start i don't know what that was <laughs> It took me a second to comprehend what I just heard. But I like this beat. The emptiness inside. Oh, I love his voice. Oh. 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 Yeah, that drummer's going in. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> what the fuck is this song? I don't know. <laughs> Bruh. Yeah. 
Dude, I, one thing I always loved about Danny's voice was just how he can always just capture the emotion with his songs. Oh, yeah. Um, it, it's, it's fucking crazy. Um, I don't know if I like the chorus. Like, at all. <laughs> Like I, I kind of like the little ending to it, but with like the blast beats, I don't know if I like them. And I'm kind of hoping it's not like that in the next chorus. I like the double kick a lot. Oh, the double kick's fine, but like within the chorus side of the way that the chorus was sounding, I don't think the blast beats should be there. All right. I don't think the first one should be there. Like the the one with the symbols. But I think I think the double kick wasn't too bad. Yeah. I don't know, but it's uh, I don't know. No, let's, let's see what we can get into. Yeah. Please no blast beats. Please no blast beats. Yeah, like this one here. I don't know. It doesn't fit it, but I'm okay with it. What? The the second one there with the double kick. It doesn't fit it, but I'm okay with it. I don't like the first one, though. It definitely doesn't fit it. I just don't like the whole chorus. The whole chorus, just, no. I, th- th- there's no need for the blast beats. Or anything like that. Maybe that's what they meant by old asking on No. <laughs> no. No. It does not sound like old asking on <laughs> Dark Void has more of a chance to sound like old as an alligator um i think the main guitarist uh ben was doing backing vocals within the uh um verse um i i really i'm really enjoying the verses i'm really enjoying the verses i'm not enjoying the choruses but ben um if you've heard not the american average he yeah. does that slow part so we know he can sing really well too. Or Danny's layering his voice in different ways. I mean, I I don't doubt it either way. But uh, yeah, oh, let's uh, let's continue. That's Ben. It's got to be Ben. Okay. Now it fits it. <laughs> now the blast beats like that. See, that's where blast beats are meant to be. Yo. That's where the blast beats are meant to be. Just the chorus? No. I, I, I cannot get behind them on the chorus. At all. Um, that is definitely a no-go for me there. Um, verses? Good. Breakdown? Good. Danny's vocals? Fucking... Good. Like, Asking Alexandria just doesn't fail no matter what. It's just that 
chorus. That chorus I cannot get behind. It's almost as I almost hate it. No, I think I hate it as much as the black. Yeah. I'll still listen to the song, it's just blast beats and the chorus name. That that is not as Alexander in that chorus at all. No matter no matter what era asking Alexander that is, that is not asking Alexander for me. What do you think? I mean, I was not expecting that breakdown though. No, I, that was actually a heavier breakdown than fucking Dark Void. Yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah, I was trying to pay attention to the lyrics. I got most of them, and then I got sidetracked with the breakdown. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Like I said when we paused it the first time there, the first blast beat with the symbols, I didn't really see the need for it, but the one with just the double kick, yeah, it didn't fit it, but it still sounded cool, and it sounded all right to me, but then at the end, it all fit it. Mm -hmm. so, That's what I'm saying. I don't dislike the song, I just dislike the chorus. Yeah. Like the the chorus is the only thing that turns me off of the song, and I I'm upset that that's what they went with for a chorus. As someone who's listened to Asking Alexander for years, no, like uh, I don't know, it, it, it's one of those things. I, yeah, like blast beats, leave that for breakdowns, leave that for like just heavy chunky parts. Not in a chorus though. Not unless it's like a death core chorus. Like Lauren kind of Ashore. Lauren Ashore, Brand of Sacrifice, like that kind of shit. Ask Alexander should not be throwing in blast beats like that. <laughs> um either way, I, I'm happy with the way Ask Alexander is coming back to the heavier side. It's still not as heavy as their older shit. But I mean Danny's vocals have definitely come a long way and he has a lot more experience with them now, so he definitely has a lot more control of those fucking lows. Like, those are low. <laughs> but, I don't know. Anything else you need really add? No. Alright. So, if you enjoyed the song and enjoyed our video... So, if you enjoyed the song and like our reaction to this song, please leave a like down below. Shut up. Um... <laughs> don't forget to like comment and subscribe and uh let's get a poll going in the comments yeah. what do you think about the blast beats and what do you think about the heaviness at the end let oh, us know the heaviness I'm all for just the blast beat <laughs> of course anyways we love you take care of yourselves and we cannot wait to see you in the next see you in psycho